hard mineral deposits that accumulate within the upper urinary tract, known as urinary calculus, are removed using various medical expulsive treatments, MET. Tamsulacin, a drug that relaxes smooth muscles of the distal ureta, is the most commonly used MET. It is used either independently or along with shockwave lithotripsy, SWL, a technique that uses shockwaves to break down urinary calculi. Tadalafil, yet another potential MET, works by relaxing the entire length of the ureta and has shown promising results in removing ureteric calculi. However, is low-dose Tadalafil more effective than Tamsulacin in achieving this outcome? A group of researchers from Christian Medical College and Hospital, Valor, India, tried to answer this question through a triple-blinded, prospective, single-center, randomized, controlled trial involving 250 patients receiving SWL. The participants had solitary renal or ureteric calculus that measured between 6 and 24 millimeters and were randomly assigned in equal numbers to one of two treatment groups, receiving either 0.4 mg tamsulacin or 5 mg tadalafil daily for 30 days or till the calculus cleared. Surprisingly, the team noted that both tamsulacin and tadalafil had a similar calculus expulsion rate, which was the primary outcome of their study. The proportion of participants who were calculus-free or had insignificant calculus fragments within the 30-day period was comparable between the two groups. Moreover, the time taken to expel the calculus was 13.59 days for tamsulacin and 13.74 days for tadalafil, the difference being insignificant here as well. In addition, they noted that the use of tadalafil was associated with adverse drug reactions, which can lead to treatment no compliance. The researchers thus conclude that low-dose tadalafil is not superior to tamsulacin in improving calculus expulsion when used as an adjunct to SWL. Future studies involving cost analysis of the two drugs may help shed more light on the comparative efficacy and applicability of the two drugs. Thank you.